Hi there, and welcome to episode 10 of my Feed the Beast Star Wolf 20 Mud Black Pack Let's Play. So, I left you last time uh, with uh, our planter planted. Look at the trees, they're all growing nicely. Um, so, now we want to harvest the trees. To do that, we just have to put down the harvester. So there's options here. We can shear the leaves as if they were sh uh, silk touched. Um, we can harvest jungle wood or that's especially useful if you want to grab cocoa and stuff like that. And so this thing spits out the back. Now I'm not sure if I can just fit item ducks directly onto this or not. But we're gonna find out. So we'll check this now and see. <coughs> and we'll wrench this so it's out. And then we'll add the upgrades. Which means it should start. This uh, creates sludge which you can use but you don't have to. This is probably going to drain the bathroom by itself completely. Yeah. Oh, and yeah, awesome. We don't need servos or a chest or anything up there. So we've loads of oak. I don't know why that's there. And this will also make apples, of course. because this thing is going to use a lot of power if it's on the whole time. There we go. We can turn it off with just the lever. So, what we want to do then is we want to send the saplings back here so we're gonna need a lot more item ducks wow that's a lot of wood already look at that So we'll plant out a whole load of this stuff now, and uh, I'm gonna go get some more item ducks. We just, yeah, Grant, we can do that. Can we burn wood? We can. Oh, 
Okay, so I'm gonna go get more item ducks and hook this up and probably get some barrels as well. So uh, I'll be back in a minute. So I've got myself a load of uh, item ducks and what we want to do is hook up this harvester to the planter. And since we only want saplings to go in, um, we can just put the sapling in there, uh, whitelist it, ignore metadata, ignore MVT, use order dictionary. Yeah, that's all fine. I'll just increase this to the max size. I'm not sure exactly if it matters or not, but. Uh, So, let's go turn this on. Oh, um, because we want it to always go this way, I think that means it would go that way, but I must check that now in a minute. So I have no saplings in here except for that one. So we'll go see if we can turn this back on now. Let's see where these things go. Disable this for a moment. And we'll see they're coming in here. So once this is full up, the sapling should go into the chest, so we'll just fill that up with cobblestone to do, and once it gets to so that's full and let's see if the saplings will come down here now And there we go, so the saplings will come in here uh, a second, we're going to move this in a minute, but if the planter is full, they come in here, and if it's not, they go into the planter. Those are different ones there, um, I don't want to use those ones. Anyway, we can turn the, this back on, and these should all get planted. And you can see the energy cell is absolutely dying. Actually, we could just push a lever. No. Okay, so next we want to pull these outputs into something else. So I've made a little hole down this way and I want to make some barrels to put these in. So we can put barrels down here.
So there. And uh, we can get rid of this chest then. So saplings as well so Boom. There we go. Uh, I need to get a bird sapling in there so it has to go there, but um, other than that. Actually, a chest here. Do we want to that? I might put it here just for something that um, the last possible place to put something. So if anything doesn't fit in like this and this that got and we can actually check this then it will get put into the chest. Otherwise it goes into the barrels. So let's just check to see how this is going. Nothing in there, so it will get a w take a while for this to fill up fully. You know what? There's no reason why that should be have to fill it up fully. We'll just use th um, that much, which means we get all the other. Okay, so we're gonna let that run for a minute while we set up the processing for these fuels. Actually, I'm gonna go pick up at one of the birch ones so that I can set it up. set up now. So, this means that we're getting our loads of wood and we're going to want to use that wood, either turn it into charcoal and use it or just use it straight away as wood. So we'll see um, what the best
best thing to do there is yeah, this thing is sucking up the energy. Okay, so we're back in a minute. So what I've done here now is I've taken the oak wood and I'm pushing it through this new furnace that I've built, which is generating some uh, charcoal for me. Um, and I might just move this up one so I can fit in a couple of more if needs be. So now I can pull out this charcoal and fuel my steam dynamos. Now I just want to put back the birch wood one. creating charcoal from the wood to fuel the dynamo dynamo yep Servo. And away we go. And yeah, I'm going to have to move this up. There we go. And these look like they're leaving one in the barrel as well, which is really cool. Let me just uh, tidy this up a bit. Actually, um, I can tidy this up a bit more. Uh, let me just go upstairs and I will show you how. So we want to get a saw. We're going to use... It doesn't particularly matter, we can use a sapphire one I suppose. So it's just stick and stone rods. And two sapphire wizards. <coughs> and a saw. So this because it looks nicer. So you saw the block. And saw it again. And saw it again. And that gives me loads of covers. And these covers. Can be put 
put over stuff like that and look at that much nicer that is but it scares me okay so um, there's our automatic production of charcoal um, so we probably add another furnace there to be honest otherwise I don't think this can keep up and these are hmm, I might actually I disabled the planter earlier and uh, it doesn't really seem like it has much power left but um it's dark as right now as well Ooh. I don't know what they are they're really scary looking though okay so I think we'll leave that there and uh, the next episode we'll, we'll start our production of biofuel from the saplings as well. So, see you around.